What's up, y'all? Go by the name of Tazzy Red, the Nazi Dread, Dade County's finest. Trail 5, what's up? Cooling it with So Gator TV as we about to vibe and chat and maybe get a little lit. You know what I'm saying? Y'all stay tuned. What's good, everybody? This is the kid, your favorite kid, Pooh Gator. You're not tuned in to another episode with Stop the Music Behind the Artist. I got a very special guest. She already introduced herself, so we ain't got to wait no more. Tazzy Red, y'all snap for that, Gator? snap for that. <laughs> Georgia. I stayed in Georgia for about four or five years. Oh, okay. So that's when I was really moving and moving with the music. I right. met a lot of good people. Don't okay. get me wrong. I met a lot of good people. I networked and everything. But right. that season is over. Okay. Now I'm in Tampa. Okay. Um, I had to come back to Florida. Florida, this Florida's me. Yeah. Florida, yeah. Florida's yeah. me. I'm a water baby. So um, I, I, for you to say that, like, was it like too too drastic of a change, or just like what, what was the big deal about Georgia compared to Florida? Um, I'm gonna be honest. Career wise, uh -huh. Georgia is where it is. Yeah, where you need to go. yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, at the time. Okay. Um, I love my city. Don't get me wrong, but mm -hmm. you already know how Miami goes. Yeah. It's not as supportive right. as Other Atlanta cities. is. Yeah, man. Right. And um, okay. Let's just be real. You can have the sorriest artist in Atlanta coming yeah. out, but they support them. You push to get that one song for a meal. That's all you need. Yeah. And be that one you need to quit. You can't find that here. That's so that's what I went and I networked and I've been moving up. Met a lot of good people. My manager's actually from, not from Atlanta, but that's what she said. Okay. And you know. Okay. That's what made me go up there. Okay. So yeah, that's why I said I want to have yo. You know, since you actually had experience with that, you know, people don't understand sometimes they think they go to another state, another city, everything all good or it's easier. But it's still a lot of ground, a lot of work you got to put in. Being a newcomer, being somebody new to the mm -hmm. city, trying to take over another city. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? It's a lot of work. Feelings, yeah. Really, yeah. But when you get the, when you find that team though, right, right, then that's it, when it's it'll easy. Work out. Yeah. All right. So what started your interest in doing music, and how long have you seriously been pursuing a music career? So yeah. I've been seriously <laughs> pursuing this music career since 2007, and wow. um, what 13, 14 years 14, in. 14. Wow. And what really um inspired me to do it as I'm a music baby. Um, right. at the end of the day, I grew up on it. I love it. Mm -hmm. Um, I learned how to play certain instruments by ear, not even okay. notes and all that first. Then we got to the notes. Okay. Um, and then that's sad. You can do that. That's yeah, sad. and yeah. it's hereditary too in, in my family. And okay. I mean, that's it's my kids, my mama. She's my number one fan. Oh, yeah? So at the end of the day, when it comes to music, it just comes naturally. You just right. sit there and freestyle and just play around. So my mom's like, yeah. why play around? Right. When right. you can pursue something. So right. that's what I've been doing. Okay. Yeah. So music is in you. It's part of your, 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 your bloodline. It's my bloodline. Your my and bloodline. I also love okay. it, though, because a lot yeah. of things could be a part of somebody's bloodline, and it's not for them. It's not for them, right? Yeah. It's not them. Right, yeah, right. You got to have a passion for it, and you was born into it, basically. Yep. Yep. Okay. So, yep. Okay. And then my kids too, they love it. Oh yeah. So and they so also they music they and they talented. One doing one doing makeup. Okay. Okay. And the other <laughs> one, we about to get we got to put her on a somebody Disney channel. I mean yeah. somebody Disney show because Lord, yeah. that girl act Character. like it. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Yeah. Gonna be just like they mom making that money, you know, start traveling around though. the world doing everything. Yeah. We yeah. Gotta start young though. Train them up in the way they should go. Yes. That's fat. Y'all yes. snap to that. Yeah. <laughs> All right. Yes. So what's the ultimate goal for your career? And I'm gonna say the next question for after you ask it. What's the okay. next goal for your career? Um, the next goal. Mm-hmm. Like the uh, yeah, like the, the, the ultimate goal. goal. Yeah, oh, the ultimate goal. Oh, the ultimate goal yeah. is to is to become a legend. Um, the ultimate goal is to have those tracks right. that will be playing for years. Mm, right. You get what I'm saying? You got right. the certain Tupac tracks and some certain Michael Biggie Jackson. tracks and certain Jack. Yeah, I was about yeah, to say Michael Jackson, Whitney. Yeah, that just yeah. they'll never die. Right. No, no. You get what I'm saying? And also, right. is to develop these these kids right. and these artists and stuff that's my main goal to use okay. all my you know wealth and riches to develop these babies right. into whatever they want to be and to lead them in the right path that's the ultimate goal right so you feel like it's possible to actually influence and have an impact with you know everything that comes along with the music industry being in it and also having a platform you think it's possible to actually it's definitely possible it's okay. not easy right but it's possible right it's possible okay Okay. Mm -hmm. See, I like that positive mindset. You know what I'm saying? You got to. Yeah. You got to have it, or else you stay stuck. Right. Right. You stay stuck in that dip. So yeah. Okay. So do you consider yourself in the box or out of the box, and why? I say that because for you to even say what you said, that's kind of out the box to a lot of people. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> I'm just so, like, I'm an out the box person. <laughs> I'm not, no not even stuck in no box. Um, 
for those who don't really know me, I, I'm very diverse right. when it comes yeah. to the music. I do that almost means, everything. Um, yeah. Mixed Feelings out right now, by the way, yeah. on all platforms. And okay, Mixed Feelings yeah. has reggae, has pop, um, reggae, R&B, okay. hip-hop. Okay. Um, the pop is coming soon. I, I didn't put the pop track on there yet, but okay. it's coming soon. So okay. just by my diversity, when you hear me spit, sing, and everything, you'll know how out the box I am. Right. And plus by my creativity period, my photo shoots. The things I try to do, right. um, the style, everything. the concepts, yeah. everything I try to make different. I don't want to be nobody else. So like that's intentional. Paralyzed. That's it's, intentional. It's intentional. Okay. It comes too, though. Yeah. How I dress and everything is different anyway. Right. Right. But it's also intentional to be different. Okay, so talking about clothing, how you dress and everything, how did Alien Apparel come about? Alienated Apparel. Okay, so alienated I've apparel been alien. trying to. Okay, so the apparel line has always been in mind. I just never had. The name. The, okay. I had three names that I was just playing around with. Yes, okay. and I couldn't uh -huh. figure out what name. Boy, on my red light show flyer uh -huh. is a uh, um, alien right in the corner. I don't think nobody really noticed it because hell, I didn't even notice that. <laughs> I got the flyer made like that for a minute. Yeah, it's an alien with a T R. Drip uh -huh. my logo that it is now. I look. I see God. Dog, that, uh, that's it know. right there, and I didn't even pay attention. Show's been out for months. A little fly, I'm promoting everything. Yeah. Didn't even realize my logo sitting right, right there. Yeah. Wow. So and I went and got, I went and got it because I always say I'm unique. I always say I'm an alien. I used to always say that. I'm, I'm not like these humans. I'm not like right. these sheep. Everybody <laughs> following them is, you know, because I think different. I'm yeah. not saying I'm the only one, but there's a lot of us who right. think different out right. of the box. Right, right. So that came and boom. Took off and it's a message. It's also a clothing line with a message. So on right. the back is the logo, the phrase I should say is um we can't we just can't fit in. We just can't fit so, in. So yeah, so it's alienated on the front and on the back it says we just can't fit in. Right. In quotations. And that really means you be yourself. Right. You, you you're the trendsetter. You're not trying to fit in with nobody, nobody. else. Right. Yeah. Right. Mm -hmm. I like that because I, I mean just as soon as I saw the, the idea behind I didn't even know all that, but I can tell like alienated, uh, alien like I'm from another world. Another world. I'm yes. always being put. You know, in another category, I, you know, being unique mm -hmm. and all that stuff. There's so many different interpretations that you can take from it. Then when I see people actually like, you like, you get a lot of love from it. People ordering, yeah, you know, ordering order. it. Mm -hmm. So it's like they connect to it too in, in their own way. So when you can do something like that, put that out there, you know, and it's a movement, it's positive. Y'all gotta salute that. Yeah, thank you. That's you the know? goal. That's the goal. Got that's the babies right. wearing them too, so we do do you sizes and all that. Okay. <laughs> because it's to teach them from young too. Right. Be, be yourself. Don't be following these gang bangers and all that shit when there's no need to. You right. know what I'm saying? Right. Right. So, yeah. what's the overall idea and concept behind it? Like, is that is, is that the overall idea? That's all it. That's is that's the concept for alienated apparel. Yeah. The whole concept is to, of course, the line, mm -hmm. and then also that message is to have everybody incorporated together. You are gonna see the events I'm gonna be coming up with. Some okay. Is okay. to have everybody coming together who's different. You get what I'm saying? I want somebody who's who look dressed like a robot and do just be yourself. Yeah. Be you. Yeah. Somebody gonna like you for you somewhere yeah. instead of you trying to. Blend in with the others so you can fit in and get the same type of, um, you know, likes and right. stuff as they say. Right. Yeah. Right. Right. That ultimate goal is to really get everybody to change that mindset of trying to do what everybody else is doing. Yeah. 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 Don't be scared to be outside the box and be your own person. Yes. I don't be scared of that. They put like, oh, oh, everybody. If I do this different, they gonna yeah. look at me like, well, right. oh well. Right. They gonna look at you anyway. <laughs> right. Exactly. Right. Doing it wrong or right in their mind, doing it wrong or right in your mind, they gonna look into it. So yep. Well, what gives them to look at? Yep. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Fair so, much. do you have any new projects or singles on the way or right now? So, Mixed Feelings, Mixed Feelings, <laughs> mixed feelings mixed is feelings. my EP that's out now, it's on all platforms right okay. now, so y'all check, check it out. So um, Apple Music, SoundCloud, Apple, Spotify, Apple, Apple Title, okay. Pandora, so iHeart, yeah, all okay. the major okay. ones, Spotify, yeah. even if you Google it, you can, you know, download through Google Play, Apple Music, all that stuff, um, okay. get it now, get it now. Mixed Feelings. Um, mixed Feelings, Let okay. Me Breathe is a single that's out already, Beauty and the Beast is also a single that's out, but Beauty and the Beast is not a part of that project. Okay. Um, Beauty, Beauty and the Beast was something that came out a few years back. Okay. Um, but once you go on there, you'll start to see okay. everything that's on there. Check it out. I'm telling you, you guys okay. will really like it. If it's not, yeah, it's a visuals? song for everybody. Um, so let Me Breathe that? visual is out. Is Vivo. Okay. It's on Vivo. Okay. okay. So let Beauty and the Beast visual Beauty is out there too. Okay. That video's been out there too. Um, okay. We getting ready. I don't want to say which one next mm -hmm. because we still debating okay. on which one if it's going to be the intimate R&B track or if it's going to be my hype track. So right. the intimate one's called Red Light Special. Of course, R-E-D-D. -D. Right, <laughs> Red Light right, Special. Right, right, right. And then Tasmania is a hype track. So, okay. you know, we, okay. we trying to debate, you know yeah. what I'm saying, which one. But I guarantee there's, there's a track on there for everybody. 
But if you want a conscious track, it's on there. If you want a nice um, dance hall little track, it's on there. Right. A hype track, if you crunk, it's on there. Okay. Um, you know what I mean? It's on for everybody. So, it's on for everybody. How, how, how many songs all together? Like it's nine. Nine, okay. It's nine Okay, for sure, for sure. So y'all make sure y'all go check that thing out. Yeah, you ain't got sure. no excuses. I always tell people that when it's everywhere, you ain't got no excuses. No excuses. I still find it. <laughs> Amen. You know? All right, so um, what motivates you and inspires you to write, record, and perform music? And then, like, you know, like, what keeps you in the game? And what's the process like when you write a song, when you go in and make a song? Um, when it inspires me, um, I just love music, period, number one. And then, like I said, my kids and my home. Mm -hmm. um, my mom, they my number. My mother is my number one fan, and a lot of people don't get that. So yeah. that's a blessing. Yeah. When you have that's a bad. parent who actually back you in right. something that is actually hard to get into. Right. It's not something you just do two, two, four years in, in right. uh, college, right. get your bachelor's degree, and go on, go on. <laughs> yeah. You can't do that. You no. Gotta, really it's a process. Yeah, yeah, man. So that and my children to give them something to fall behind. Yes, I have alienated apparel and everything, but that music right. come first. Right. You right. get what I'm saying? That's I mean, the, that was birth from. That's what it's birth from. Exactly. The, even the alien got let, got the headphones on. The headphones on. Yeah, I see. see? Yeah, I see. Oh, wow. I love you. That very touch of the detail. Yeah, right? I, got, I got you. I got you. <laughs> but yeah, that's exactly what um fall behind. And my process of me writing a song, mm -hmm. I listen to the melody. Whatever the melody come, my melody come with it. Right. Mm -hmm. Whatever melody I feel like. Flow with the beat, then mm -hmm. come the lyrics. Okay. And then it just flows right in. Continuity, just yep. come together. Okay. So is it like um like you gotta, you know, light some up, take drinks, take Oh shot. well Ganja Baby, of course, let me breathe if you see that. That'll it's yeah. a very it's a good message, but it's definitely a smoke song. Okay. <laughs> so okay. um I don't really drink like that, I'll drink here and there, but yeah, okay. I definitely I definitely it elevates your mind again. I definitely elevate, right. yes. Okay, okay. Yes, okay. I definitely elevate my mind and, and Fly. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Let the music notes take me away. Okay. Yeah. Truly, truly. Yeah. That's when it's you know natural and it's you know what I'm saying. That's what makes it fun. And you just being yourself. Mm -hmm. just, I'm just being yourself. Just letting you know it go. Yep. Yeah, exactly. Exactly. Okay. So um, what's next for you? Let them know what can they expect to see for the rest of 2021 from Tajiri. Y'all gonna see Double a D. lot for the rest of 2021. We only a month. What six five. Five. Yeah, five. So I'm about to turn a big three five on Memorial Day. Okay. Ooh. Okay. I'm not afraid to show my age. Yeah. Cause um, you know what I'm saying. It's a blessing it's to a even blessing. be this far with Truly. everything that's been going on. Yeah. So for 2021, expect well the EP's out. So expect more visuals. I'm talking about more visuals, more events, more shows. Mm -hmm. Um, I'm gonna okay. be throwing more shows too down here. I'm gonna get with you. Okay. Okay. Um, yeah, sure. What else? Uh. That's all oh, the apparel line. We're gonna have pop up shops okay. and stuff like that to have other vendors and stuff. Like we right. we have a lot. So you built on the brand. Like you got this logo and you got another that make another logo. Like are you planning to like expand it to the point where it's different? Like, um, I'm gonna keep alienated apparel it. Okay. But for those who want to uh, franchise, you get what I'm saying, okay. or come in and build their own stuff, I have right. no problem helping. Okay. okay. With that, you get what I'm saying, and making it a part of something. Like if right. they wanted to be like an alienated apparel, if you. Uh, like I get what you're saying, right. or if I'm like if it's a studio production or entertainment right. or something, right, right, right. I might, I might right. stretch it. Right, right, right. I might stretch it into that. Alienated production, alienated apparel, yeah, I, I, I might, I might expand. Yeah. That's a good idea, Gabe. Yeah, we're, yeah. we're gonna have to chat. Yeah. <laughs> That's a good idea. No, I'll be here with it. We're gonna have to chat, most of. For sure. But we got a lot going on. Okay, Expect I see. A lot. I see, because I see you came out here, the little photo shoot you got working. Yeah, and I came by and home. helped, yeah. yeah, yeah Stop yeah, by, yeah. check y'all out at yeah. the um, showcase and yeah. stuff. Yep. I, as much as I can, I will, but I've been busy. Right. I'm always yeah. tired, girl. Yeah, I know, man. I'm always tired. It's going to get hours in the day, in the hours in the day, in the days of the week. At all. For real. At all. <laughs> yeah. All right, so. Instagram, Facebook, both of those are Tazzy Red, T-A-Z-Z-Y-R-E-D. D. I'm D. going to specify and keep right. emphasizing that D. D. Me out. D. <laughs> because that's how you're going to find me. Yeah, there's yeah. a lot of people with red this, red that, red yeah. this, but the Tazzy Red, that's how you're going to find me. Anyways, you may um, have a double D too. That's been your forever. Like, that's, 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 the, yeah. that's the point. See, you yeah. understand. Yeah, I got you. Yeah. I, got you. I, got you. I got you. You understand. I got you. Um, yeah, so Facebook, Instagram, those are two. Twitter is T R E D D 1 4. So T Red 14 is Twitter. YouTube is Tazzy Red. Um, the Vivo is up now, so if you just put in Tazzy Red, I'm going to pop up. Personal page and the Vivo page will pop up. And that's about it. I'll get to TikTok soon. We're going to start these little challenges soon. But um, that's it for now. That's it for now. Or you can email me too at uh, Tazzy Red, T A Z Z Y R E D D 31 at gmail.com. And my manager is Rena Creeps. And that's R I N A with a K Creeps, K R E E P S 2020. 
at gmail.com or look us up on social media. That might be the easiest way. Yeah, we're gonna make sure we get them all the information though. You know, case they yeah, most most deaf, most yeah, deaf. Yeah. Appreciate you. Y'all want a book, y'all want a feature, y'all want you know what I'm yeah, saying? Collab, any of that, that stuff. Collab, yeah. Yeah. You, you know. Order some stuff, you could do that too. We have our separate pages, but yeah. as far as the music, hit me up. Yeah. Hit me up. Hope y'all was taking y'all notes. I learned a lot, you know what I'm saying? Like I didn't know that you was as deep as you is, you've been in as long as you have and that you've been building and branding along the way. You know what I'm saying? And that's just working progress, that's what it's about. Building towards a goal, seeing it seeing someone come to pass and then working mm -hmm. towards a high goal. Yep. And I actually see you doing that, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, I respect I respect that. That's why I'm like, man, you gotta come through, we gotta sit down and chat. Most well, definitely. I'm yeah. definitely gonna come back. You know, yeah, that's what sure, people sure to understand though is that a lot of times while pursuing this stuff you hit rock right. bottom sometimes you're gonna hit rock bottom yeah and you're gonna have to build yourself all the way back up it takes money to make money yeah. especially with stuff like this yeah that's a so, fact yeah that's a fact that's inspiration right there too man you know you tell somebody else it, it might seem hard now so it might have happened but that don't mean it's the end and it gets greater right it gets greater it gets greater mm -hmm. most definitely true well y'all already know why you're on the kid your favorite kid gator it's right here it's tazzy red y'all go check out go check out that music mixed feelings all out on every single platform no excuses peace Woo! all right studio what